There we go. Happy new day, new afternoon, new evening, and new night, you full of wonder souls, and welcome to the Angelic Expressive Connections Connections channel. I am Angelica Stevenson. How are y'all doing? I'm so nervous and I'm trying not to be, but I'm just gonna go with this flow. We'll go with the nervousness and we'll ride it out, right? So the reason for this video is because as a mother of seven children, six in the flesh, one in death, uh, one of the things that I always say about my children is that they are my best teachers. And on this journey, um, as a mother, um, I have an expression called the healing healed mother. You know, I've talked about a little bit on my channel and also my angelic expressive connections, uh, podcast, check that out on YouTube, Amazon, Spotify, and anchor and other places too. And I am a parent, I'm a mom, but I've learned how to, I've learned and am still learning how to be a mother and parent, how I want to be, how I've always dreamed and envisioned myself before I became a mother and then when I found out I had a mother and when I found out I was going to be a mother and then when and then how my children need me to be as individuals and also as a whole and what I do works and I'd be I'd, I'd be very humble about it y'all um when people say oh my god your, your children they listen so well they're so well behaved how do you get them to listen when I have them lined up in a like having them lined up in the store or on the wall waiting for me somewhere when we're at events um at my husband's job i get so many compliments about how do you stay so calm how do you stay so patient what is your secret how do you do it right so um seven year seven children and now 11 years later well 10 years later because i did this before my son turned, my eldest son turned 11 on November 9th. I wrote down how I actually do what I do. I wrote down my parenting secrets, my perfect parenting secrets, I should say. And I am sharing them with you. And with my perfect parenting secrets, I want you to know that they are adaptable. You are able to adapt them to you, who you are, your parenting style, your child, your family, okay? So you need to do, you need to use it and you can use it to how it works best for you. And I'm able to do that because my expertise is my natural gift is to see and make connections. I am, I am analytical, I analyze, and then I'm able to communicate them in a relatable way so that, so that it becomes personal to you. So you will be able to connect to it, adapt it to your, to your own way, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns about how to do it, go on to a comment and I'll help you. But um, yeah, so this is the introduction to my program called um <laughs> called Accessing the Perfect Parent Within Master Program to help you be the parent that you want to be and to be the parent that your child needs you to be. Because when you become a parent, your individual life does not go away. It just, you just need to learn how to balance, to, to now balance it with your now family life. And I help you to do that so that you can reach and be successful in the goals and dreams and what you deserve and desire for yourself and your family. And I'm going to share with you my 12 parenting secrets. It's going to be a 13 day uh, upload, y'all. So make sure you subscribe so you know when it comes available. But before I share my six with you, I need you to be open up to it. I need you to open up yourself to new knowledge to new information and by doing that i need you to let go and get rid of everything well not let go not everything but put to the side everything that you know about the word perfect all the negative connotation the ne the negative context around it how that word is used its definition i need you to put to the side and start uprooting all those um doubtful phrases and sayings people say like there's no handbook to parenting um you're never going to get it right yada 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 um anything that anybody has ever said to you when you came a parent or before you came a parent even now as you parent i know there are some things that were taught to me by family and sometimes strangers you know that i have to continuously change my way of thinking like 
one of my sayings is a change mindset will produce a change in behavior. So each and every day I am changing what my mind is set on. I am reprogramming my mind. I am reprogramming my thoughts, my feelings, which are my emotions that move and that move people and things to and away from me and my body from my actions and my choices. So I can be the mom that I want to be, right? And I need to do that too. And we're going to start by doing that. And once you're done doing that, then you're ready. You know, you're ready. Um, you're ready to begin planting new seeds inside of you. And that begins with knowing another meaning of the word perfect. And that is the etymology of the word perfect. Etymology means the origins of words. As you know, if you don't know, the English language is made of different words like Latin and Greek and French. So... As, you, as you've seen, words words and their meanings change over the years. You know, that's why there's so many definitions to the English language and the English words that we use. And sometimes the etymology, the original where they came from has been forgotten. And I'm here to help you remember that, especially when it comes to the word perfect. So the online etymology dictionary is what you're gonna go to. And I definitely want you to go there for yourself so you can see it for yourself make your own connections for yourself and receive your own guidance, you know, your own understanding, your own whatever, you know, <laughs> for yourself. All right. So let's just start with the word perfect. And thank you for your patience as I do this. Here we go. So I'm going to share my screen with you Give me a moment. The first thing we're going to start with is the adjective of the word perfect. And I hope y'all can see this because, uh, you know, let me know if you can't. And then I'll just type it in. Um, so it says early 15th century classical correction of Middle English, parfait, flawless idea as century. 1300, can you give me a water bottle? And then what I want you to focus on and pay attention to, I'm going to start getting out with a pencil here so I can start drawing, is when it says, it also means complete, full, finished, lacking in no way from old French parfait, late 14th century, late 11th century. That means these, the, these are the meanings of perfect before the year 2000s, you know, in the 90s and 80s before all of that. Finished, completed, ready from Latin perfectus, completed, excellent, accomplished, exquisite. You know, look at these meanings. These are the meanings of perfect that nobody talks about, that nobody says, that nobody speaks or thinks upon that self. And when I saw that and began to learn that for myself, what I saw right there, it was that me and you are perfect parents because we have been completed. We are full, we are finished, and we are lacking in no way with everything that we need and everything that we want to be parents to our children, to raise them in how they should go, to raise them in how they need to go, to raise them how we want them to be, and also to help them be raised in how they also want to be as well with a balanced and balanced perfection. It is there. You are a perfect parent. You are a complete, finished work of art from conception. Ever since the sperm hit the egg that made you, you are complete. You have been completed. You are finished. You are ready. You are all ready to be a parent and you just have to start accessing that perfection within yourself you have to start believing it thinking it feeling it seeing it conjuring it up asking for it speaking upon yourself and over all of that because it's already there for you like you are already it you are there people say there's no handbook to parenting well guess what you have the hands it's your hands what you do your hands you are the book. Isn't the same? You are the author of your story. It's your book, handbook, you, you're the author of your story. Within you is the pages, is the ink, is the idea, is the conception, is, is all of that to be a perfect parent, to be the perfect parent that you were created to be. And it doesn't stop there. Like, you scroll down. Okay, I got, I got to stop sharing my screen. Stop sharing my screen and then share my screen again so we can go down to the, not the adjective of perfect, but to the verb as in an action, you know, of perfect. Verb is a word, is an action word. If you could do it, you could do it, you could do it. It's a verb. <laughs> Have fun teaching. 
if you're uh, teaching your children um, learn uh, how to read or words or nouns or e or English language arts, and you just want them, you know, to keep learning every single day, all day, all the time. Me and my family have subscribed to Have Fun Teaching. They got beats. <laughs> it's contagious. It's awesome. Uh, so check it out. Have Fun Teaching. And no, I'm not getting paid for. No, no I'm not getting paid to show that. Uh, I just love it. And I know people and other families have loved it too when I share it with them. And then when I see people walk in the mall. So side note, also still about parenting, um, which involves being a perfect parent and being who you want to be and who you are. And I can wear what everybody else thinks or says. Like a couple of years ago, we were walking through Walmart and one of the have fun teaching songs, it talks about the seasons of the year. It goes, here we go. Oh, seasons of the year. You know, it's really cool. It's really dope. And me and them were just singing it in the Walmart, just dancing, even me, you know. And I walked past the parent and this mom was smiling. She's like, yep, yeah, I know what she's talking about. I know what you want. This the song is dope. Like she got it too. It was pretty awesome. And that's the type of thing that I that I love, that, that that's who I am. I will sing. I will start dancing. I will do, you know, if I'm in the groove and the mood with my children, even by myself, I'll do it. And I don't really care what people think or say, you know, <laughs> because that's just who I am. And it's very helpful too. When it comes to dealing with the emotions, especially if it's sad or angry, be able to be silly, dance, have fun, and be spontaneous and adventurous and do things that you know that you know that would make your child happy in that moment, in that situation. The drop of a hat is very important and not worrying about what other people say. So yeah, half my teaching, singing, dancing, perfect parent right there. I'm a perfect parent. Yeah. So the verb for perfect parent means to bring to full development finish or complete so as to leave nothing wanting so to bring to full development so to order to bring the perfectionist within you it begins when you become a parent like actually it begins from conception however when you start when you choose to become a parent that development continues you know it's coming full circle it's coming full circle and it's all there with you and there is um you, you keep doing it. You know that there's nothing, you're not, you're not lacking in any way. And then with your children, when you take the time to stop and listen to them, to observe them, to watch them, to hear them, they help you to access that perfection from within you, from within yourself. Like I said, my, te my children are one of my first and best, well, one of my best teachers that helped me to be a better human being, better wife, better person, better woman, all of that. And when it comes to being a perfect parent, when it comes to being a perfect parent and bringing to full development, finish or complete so as to leave nothing wanting, each day that you're giving, each day that you are, are given with your child is a day to complete that perfection. It's a day to walk in it. It's a day to be who you want to be, to do what you want to do, to have that relationship with your child, that experience with your child every single day, okay? And yeah, that is it, right? So I sent an, um, an email to my subscribers because I started doing this first with them and I was like, you know what? I'm going to share this with everyone because... It, it needs to be shared. So what I share with my subscribers, with my email subscribers, is ways that they can um, start helping them to have that new mindset, to have that new change within themselves, to start asking the perfect parent within. And as I said, it starts with how, with how you think about yourself, and think about your life, think about your family, think about your children. It starts with how you feel. It starts with how and with what you speak. So whenever you watch this, you can start putting into practice by saying, I am, I am a perfect parent. I have been created to be a perfect parent. I am the perfect parent to deal with this situation in this, in this moment. I have all the perfect answers within me to know what to do. Like I am open to receive the answers from inside out and from outside in. Like you can say these type of words, do these type of actions, think these type of thoughts. And however you need to and what feels comfortable and feels good and feels right and feels like truth to you to be that perfect parent, to be the perfect parent that you are and that you are created and that you are born to be. All right. So that is actually it for this video, for this um, video one. 
fro or introducing um my master program accessing the perfect parent accessing the perfect parent within and beginning to share my 12 parenting secrets my 12 parenting secrets with you my 12 perfect parenting secrets is different because they're perfect parenting secrets and i'm gonna do one video each day every day and if you'd like to get a head start i have made a um a sample course of the first secret of the first of my perfect parenting secrets is actually the foundation of all my perfect parenting secrets it's called the one breath one moment one situation at a time course you can download um a copy of it when you subscribe to be an email to the street counselor e, e newsletter at www.streetcounselor.com forward slash free parenting secret i hope spitting just come out because i would have been I don't say gross, but my bad. Um, <laughs> that didn't happen. Um, so that's street s t r e e t counselor c o u n s e l o r dot com forward forward slash free parenting secret f r e e p a r e n t i n g s e c r e t. Okay, so streetcounselor.com forward slash free parenting secret or forward slash parenting secret uh, to download the first secret from accessing the perfect parent within you master program by becoming an email subscriber. So get that done and I'll see you then on the inside and make sure to subscribe. If you like this, if you know that this video can help somebody, definitely share it. If you know people who, if, if it can help somebody, but they're more of an audio person, I'm also recording these as episodes on my podcast, Angelic Expressive Connections. I will put the link for that, for the introduction for that as well. Um, so you can share that with others. If you want to use some hashtags to so make sure you stay aligned and to reference to me, it is hashtag the healing healed mother, hashtag THHM, hashtag free parenting secret, hashtag, sorry, hashtag perfect parenting secret hashtag perfect parents or hashtag i am a perfect parent you can hashtag i'm a perfect parent because you are and also hashtag the connecting angel as well because my soul is the connecting angel and that's it so i want y'all to go go be the perfect parent that you are you've already been given permission to be a perfect parent you have everything in you you have been completed you are finished you're ready and you are lacking in no way to be the parent that you want, be the parent that your child needs every day, every moment, every situation, every time for you, their lives, and your family. So get it. All right. So until next time, uh, as you remember, um, and everything I do, I am nourishing the connecting seeds in you to help you walk in your soul's purpose, to fulfill and complete your life's missions with the gifts, the talents, and the powers within me. And continue to put in that work. Um, are you ready? You ready? All right. You're not ready? You are ready? Are you going to do it from down there or from up here? You can come up here with me. You're going to do it from down there? All right. My daughter says she wanted to sing my song with me. So it's called Put In That Work. Uh, Here we go. Uh, do you think they can hear you from down there? Uh, put that mind work in. Get your thoughts right. Put that. No, hold on. Hold on. That's too loud. Come come up here so you're not that loud. You, you can bring the blanket with you because that want to hurt Elena's ears and wake people up. The rest of our family is sleeping. All right, here we go. Uh, uh. Put, that Put that mind work in. in. Get, get your thoughts, thoughts right. right. Put it's that so heart cool. work in. Get it's your so feelings cool. right. Put that spirit work in. Get your energy right. You want that life? that you see in your dreams she's tired you want that life that you wrote in your goals because you've been visualizing it's manifestation time so get that butt in gear and get your body up because you've got work to do ain't no time for you to snooze <laughs> are you really ready to lose not me no way and Mother Universe ain't done with you. You, 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 oh, y'all. <laughs> so what you gonna do? Put in that work. Uh, uh, put in that work. Uh, uh, put in that work.
put in that work. <laughs>